Um, hello, my name's Emer. Um, sorry, hello, my name's Emer Hassett. Um, my educational journey started in UCD in 2000. I did a Bachelor of Architecture there. So I finished that in 2007 and after that I worked in industry for about two years. So the big recession happened um, and at that point I was trying to kind of upskill and trying to look, take my career in a different direction. So I looked at a lot of different courses in Ireland um, and the course that was most suitable as a follow on to my undergrad was a Masters in Environmental Systems here in GMIT. So the reason that that course was so good was because it gave you the option to choose your modules. And there was also many different modules that suited architecture and it gave me an opportunity to move from my undergraduate discipline into a different role. So in that course I did subjects like environmental impact assessment, um, energy systems, construction and demolition waste management, um, which would come in very useful in later years when I'm doing project management, do things like municipal waste management, which I had no experience in before, but uh, I found that was really useful. One thing that I found that was really good about the, the masters was the freedom that you were given. Um, you got so many options in your subject choice that you could tailor the course to yourself. On top of that, you got to do a minor thesis, which again was the topic you just you chose yourself. So I was given the opportunity to work with the HSE. So I uh, recognised a problem to do with the uh, the growing elderly population in Ireland and provision of services for them. So an initiative has been released by the HSE to create a number of community nursing units, which are kind of hospitals made for the elderly. The cost of running these units were very, very high. Uh, so with support from GMIT, I was able to create a minor thesis that worked with the HSE and proposed looking at post-occupancy evaluations of these buildings in order to reduce their cost of running. So this um, thesis uh, had the output of recommendations for the HSE, which are currently under review. So following on from that, I realised that I really enjoyed working with communities and trying to engage in change management and community acceptance of renewable energy technologies. Um, so a PhD position came up looking at sustainable energy communities. So I proposed that we would look at the community aspect of these communities. Um, that led to um, the creation of a project in Inishir, looking at the creation of a sustainable energy community. Um, so the PhD I'm doing is looking at the implementation of a framework um, for developing sustainable energy communities in Ireland. So I was lucky enough that through GMIT we'd organised um, a case study uh, topic for this. So this is looking at Inishir Island. Um, so Inishir is the smallest of the Aran Islands. Uh, it's got a population of about 300 people. And the interesting thing about Inishir is that it's got a very unique heritage. Um, and it's also a very small community in a rural context. So the PhD is looking at how to get people engaged in sustainable energy community and also looking at how can you tailor a framework to the small rural environment in Ireland. There's an initiative of the Iron Islands Energy Co-op to get uh, the Iron Islands 100% self-sustainable, energy sustainable by 2022. So my research is going to try and tie in with that. Um, so what is novel about this PhD is that along with looking at renewable energy technologies, it's always looking at the social science um, of energy and how can you engage with communities in order to change their behaviour, in order to look at them taking more action towards achieving sustainable energy communities. Um, so the th one thing that I like the most about GMIT is the opportunity to work with different disciplines. And uh, when I was in architecture, I only studied with architects and worked with architects. So when I came into the masters, I was given the opportunity to work with scientists, to work with marine biologists, to work with civil engineers, um, lots of different types of engineers, which actually was giving me an awful lot more experience than if I had just worked with people of my own profession. Um, and on top of that, GMIT gives the opportunity to, to be yourself. And it's the one place that it's, it's not alone okay to be different, but it's actually encouraged. Uh, so when I was looking for a master's, I was very keen to get a master's in Galway because um, as an architect, it's a city that's um, full of culture and art. And there's always something happening in Galway from arts festivals, films festivals, to theatre productions. Um, it's great restaurants, it's great nightlife as well. And it's a very small community. Uh, you'd be surprised when you walk up the street how many people you actually know.